Hello, my name is Seth Chen. I'm the Director of Client Engagement here at Helio Consultants in Dubai. Uh, today I would like to talk about one of my UAE clients, one of my ESCOM clients, uh, based here in UAE, uh, that approached us uh, back in 2020 to establish a branch office in Iraq. Uh, the client was looking to set up in Baghdad to provide uh, IT services. This client is an end-to-end -end, uh, IT services provider, uh, mainly for corporate entities. And uh, we're looking, had gotten a contract in Iraq that they wanted to execute. Uh, so we decided, we, we, we advised the client to establish a branch mainly because uh, setting up an LLC would require uh, the client to appoint a local uh, shareholder in Iraq who would hold 51% shares in their company, as it is in most of the Gulf countries. Uh, so once we decided on the branch office, uh, the client, uh, we provided the client with a checklist of documents needed to advance the engagement as well as our, our, our engagement letter and, and an invoice for branch setup. Uh, the client provided us the documents that we needed and settled our fees uh, before we could start the process. Uh, thereafter, we drafted a board resolution and the power of attorney that would allow us to act on behalf of the client. Uh, the client had to attest these documents in uh, Dubai at the Iraqi embassy, as well as uh, the parent company's certificate of incorporation uh, of financial statements for the last two years, as well as uh, uh, their the license. Uh, once this was done, uh, the client couldn't all these documents to, to Iraq. Now my team received the documents in, uh, in Baghdad and proceeded to draft the articles of, articles of incorporation and submitted uh, the branch registration application at the uh, Baghdad Chamber and the trade registry for approval. Uh, within a period of three weeks, uh, we got uh, the pre-approval uh, for the branch registration and provided our client with this approval before my team then proceeded to uh, to submit an application for branch registration and licensing. Uh, uh, the application took an unusually long time, uh, it took at least seven weeks uh, to get approval. Normally the process takes at least four weeks, maximum five weeks to get approval, but due to delays related to COVID, uh, the approval was only given uh, after after seven after eight weeks, seven eight weeks. Once we received this approval, uh, the client had appointed one one of his uh, employees, who's based in Iraq as his local manager, uh, to hasten and fasten the process of setting up the branch. Uh, being instead of us applying for a residence permit for him to be the manager of the branch. Uh, so once the company, once the branch was registered, we, we arranged, we approached the local bank, we arranged a meeting for the local branch manager uh, to visit the, the bank office to sign bank forms. Uh, my team or my, our lawyers in, in Iraq accompanied the client, to the, the branch manager to the bank and assigned the bank for assisted them with the, the process of opening the bank account, signing bank forms, submitting the application. Again, during this period after submission of the uh, bank account application, there were some issues in Iraq, security-related issues uh, that uh, uh, that involved ISIS, and the bank, the central bank of Iraq, uh, seized or stopped all account openings across all banks. Uh, so we had to wait until the central bank lifted this ban or this uh, uh, temporary close of account opening, uh, which took at least two and a half weeks. Uh, once this was lifted, we again approached the bank and uh, to hasten or to fasten the process of opening the account. The account was approved three weeks after the lift of the, of the bank by the central bank and uh, the bank emailed our client directly with the account numbers. Once this was done, uh, the, client, the client requested us to courier all the documents to his contact uh, in Baghdad, which we promptly did, we did immediately. Uh, the client is currently planning to travel to Iraq. His best in Dubai is planning to travel to Iraq uh, to meet his manager there and uh, to start operations. Uh, if you need any more information regarding setting up a branch office uh, or an LLC in Iraq or getting any uh, necessary approvals across different sectors, uh, please reach us uh, through, uh, through our website www.hillyconsultants.com. Uh, please share and like this video. Thank you.